start with Clay Hall. Right here. Congratulations. You clearly, it seemed, used your time away to Ohio State's benefit. You, did you feel, uh, you look sharp, running and throwing. How did you feel out there? Uh, before I answer that question, I just want to say I'm proud of King and uh, what he stepped in and led his team when I was out. And uh, I look at him as a big brother and uh, no kind of racing with that. So. And talk about your, your play tonight, stepping back in there after being out for almost three weeks. Uh, well, you know, I, uh, I've been working really hard these last couple of weeks because nothing hurt. You know, my fundamental wise, and, you know, Coach Herman and Coach Wire, they always talk about fundamentals, and that's what I'm working on. That's how I get my fingers going, and you know, I can't get all the words to myself. Here's Richard, Tim, right in front. Yeah, Braxton, you got off to a really hot start. Just talk about how, you know, four touchdown passes. Uh, how'd you feel out here? It felt pretty good. It was a good, it was a good crowd, man. You know, uh, it's always a great, great crowd with my guys, and it felt pretty good. My legs feel good, um, energy wise, and you know, I wasn't out of shape, so yeah. <laughs> felt good. But then fourth quarter, what, what, what kind of went on there? I mean, you, you guys couldn't yeah. get that first down you needed a couple times there. What, 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 what kind of was going on there? Uh, we all uh, backed off just a little bit because uh, they was running this type of blitz coverage, and uh, we just wanted to run the ball and just run the clock out. All right, left, Austin. Braxton, did you feel like you had something to prove tonight? There, it seemed like it became popular for the last couple of weeks to stir up this controversy. Did, did you want to send any message with your own play? Oh, no, 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 no. You know, I just go out there and have fun and uh, be my team. I was supposed to be led and you know, just have fun and then, you know, be blessed come along with that. And I don't really look into it. We can deal with that. So, no bother at all. <laughs> Weird, right, Obi? <laughs> Do you feel like this was a? Uh, how you doing? So good, good. good. Oh hey, uh, do you feel like this was a good game, a good icebreaker for the Big Ten? Uh, was this a game that kind of needed to see kind of where you were, not where the team was? I love playing the big games, man. I bring excitement to myself and the team, and that's what we talk about all the time. We love night games, and just like last year, and um, we just stepped up this little bit different game plan, and. Um, Defense was good. It's not some, you know, it was good defense, and uh, we just had a good game plan, so it came out well. Well, and um, it might fall hard to them. Right over here on the right. Hey, Braxton, can you talk about the deal right at the end of the first half, almost an interception, and then the next play, forty-yard touchdown pass? Man, it slipped on me, but you know I can't make excuses. It was all me. And, uh, it was a bad ball by me. And I told Coach I still was in, and uh, I went up for the next throw. Uh, down here to left, I think we had a question. Yeah, uh, Braxton, same question, but uh, follow up on that. Um, did you tell him, let's do it again? T tell us how it went down. Coach Harmon know how I like it. So, you know, I don't really got to say too much. And I just looked at the sideline, he already knows what's going on. So, good game. Over here on the right, Jerry. Braxton, because of the way you normally play the game, was there any hesitation or, or any concern going in about tucking it, running the football because of what you were coming off of? Uh, not at all. I uh, worked pretty hard. I was in there all day. I probably got it. Job when I'm getting paid. <laughs> I was getting there before the coach was getting there, so I was taking care of my body. I just felt good. I was conditioned all the time. I'm an underwater treadmill, and uh, it felt pretty good. Second round, of the middle. You, you talked about that last drive before the half. You just kind of discussed the importance of that drive to kind of be the score to get back a little bit of momentum. And then also, that seemed to be the first time you really cut it was running was on that drive. Was there any hesitation early in the game to kind of test the knee? Yeah, just a little bit in the beginning of the game. How things get tight and you loosen up after a while, but um, the drive before the half, it opened up a lot. Plus, we came out and just ball again and um, just had to set the tone for us. Over to the left, Doug. Rex, is the knee 100% at this point, or how close to 100%? Yes, sir, it's, it's good, it's 100%. And I just bring the knee brace with precaution and uh, just keep it real tight. So. And what was the process like for you the past couple weeks of trying to decide, are you going to play, or are you not going to play? Did, did you think maybe you were going to play last week? What was that like for you personally? No, we uh, we had off on that, you know, because you know it's, it's a different type of, type of game, and we want to be prepared for the same conference. And, uh, I just want to rest my knee for another week, so I'll be absolutely 100 percent so I can give all my all. In the middle, second round. Preston, heading into tonight, did you expect to take all the snaps? What's that? Heading into tonight, did you expect to take all the snaps? Uh, you know, it's because of the season. You know, I worked pretty hard in practice, and uh, you know, me and Kenny just like like a relationship. 
did they give you a decision before the game? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> Got time for a couple more uh, far left in the yeah. back. Back here on your left. Yeah. Right the ESP. Uh, it looked like Kenny was one of the first guys out to celebrate with you after your touchdown passes. The first two I remember specifically. Um, did you expect anything different from Kenny in those moments? And no, not at all. How, did, how did it feel to have his support in that moment? Like I said, that's why I'm up here for ever since I'm got here. We have a connection. And uh, we roommate every game. So we talk about things outside of football. No, I don't know anything outside of football. So we hang out all the time. And, you know, it's, it's happy to see him. Happy for me, you know, just be back on the field and just be the team. Last question on him on the right. Braxton, how do you think the offense looked? Overall, I mean, it's kind of hard to look at it in the moment, but you can step outside of the moment and just look at it overall as crisp as you would like it to be. No, we got a lot of little corrections to make, especially in the game tomorrow. And, uh, just, it's just a little thing we got to fix from uh, the game. A little deep balls on these couple of times. And we got it back, so we fought pretty hard, and the guys play well, so we can't really tell. Braxton, thank you. Okay, appreciate it. Thanks, Braxton.